What is up guys and girls, my name is Lutzy Guy and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Omicron. In the last episode, we made it here to Blackfish City, bought a bunch of stuff which sounds so very entertaining and we are going to take on the gym leader today. Well, maybe not the gym leader, but we're going to certainly take on the gym today. Doubt we'll get to the gym leader himself, but hey, we can try. So I know this gym is entirely psychic type, so Eve is probably going to play a big part in this. Oh, whoops, accidentally typed out. You don't have a chance. You don't have a chance getting to our gym leader. Well, I have a dark type Pokemon, so I think I have a decent chance at least. Masharna. Hmm. They are quite a lot stronger than I anticipated, honestly, and I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Defense curl, that makes it quite a lot worse, especially for me. However, Musharna's down relatively easily. I think Eve will certainly get a ton of experience out of this, which is going to be amazing. Wobbuffet, uh, let's keep Eve in. I actually should probably give Eve the, what's it called, the luck incentive, I think, or something like that. Counter, ooh. Yeah, that's one thing I was sort of afraid about. So let's put in Twee. And we will heal up. We will heal up, um... I gave no one the lucky egg. Wow, I feel so smart. I'm gonna heal up Eve. Miracote does absolutely nothing. Okay. Let's just finish off this Wobbuffet real quick. What? Ooh, I'm not I'm not a fan of the fact that now it has Destiny Bond. Uh Whatever, I guess. It's gonna go down anyway. And there goes Twee. Alright, whatever. Let's put Eve back in. What are they sending out next? Espeon. Alright, we shouldn't have much trouble with Espeon, honestly. He's Crunch. And I should probably give Eve the Lucky Egg back since Eve's gonna just basically be our main Pokemon throughout this. Gardevoir. This one's gonna be a bit scarier since Gardevoir... Has a lot more type coverage and everything, but for the most part, I think we have- we don't have much to worry about. Okay. Because I know Gardevoir, I believe, actually learns, like, a Thunder-type move. If not, it can learn. So I was sort of afraid that something like that would happen. Luckily, it did not. Let's go- Oh God, what's going on there? I'm gonna go heal up real quick, BRB. So my plan of action here is basically- Okay, question one. True or false? The Ground-type is weak to the Poison-type. False. So my plan of action here is to have Twee in the front with the luck- Wait, what is it? I want to make sure I don't mess up the name. Luck and sense. I said in- I think I said incentive or something earlier, but... Basically, we're gonna have Twee out in the front so we can double our earnings and then we'll switch out to Eve. Should work out pretty well, or so I would assume. So having Twee in first will allow us to double our earnings, then we can switch to Eve and just sort of quickly take down their team, or so I would hope. Grumpig's a bit bulkier, so I don't know. Yep. Uh, Power Gem did a decent amount earlier, but it's down now, so that's what matters the most, I suppose. Uh, Executor... I'm gonna put in mags for this one, mostly so I can heal Eve. Because I have a bad feeling that one of their Pokemon is going to be able to damage Eve. And mags doesn't really have much to worry about against Executor. As far as, far as I know. Size Shark. Okay, maybe that's something to worry about. Jeez. No, don't go to bag. Okay, Lava Plume. Oh, I was afraid of that. Oh, come on, really? That's kind of annoying, honestly. 
Alright, I think Eve can just quickly finish him off. Uh, Crunch? Sure. So my team certainly needs some leveling up. Is the big- that's like the big problem right now. Bronzong, oh no. That's kind of why we needed mags. Let's hope Eve can do well against Bronzong, I guess. Uh, that wasn't super effective. Heavy slam. Oh, boy. That's kind of scary. So I'm gonna quickly heal up mags. I have a feeling Eve's gonna go down. Apparently not. Okay, I think we should be able to take it out. And we weren't, so that's a bit of a problem. And Eve can't heal now, that's kinda bad. Or at least I don't think- Or at least I don't think Eve can use healing type moves. I could be wrong, I don't know. Something along those lines. Bohem, um... Hmm, what are we gonna do here? Uh... I think I'm gonna put in Frank who would just go for a... Just go for Hydro Pump. Cause I'm pretty sure... Behem, however you say it, is part rock. Hopefully. If not, that's- okay, it's not. That's kind of a bad thing. Another one might do the trick? Okay, it did, thank god. Oh, that sound hurts my ears. <laughs> okay, that gave Franku a nice amount of experience, though, so... I'm not too angry about it. <laughs> I'm gonna go heal up again. Alright, so let's continue on through here. What do we got? Question 2. What Pokémon are known as the Creation Trio? Um, I believe that's Diogo, Palkio, Giratina. Okay, yes, it is. Uh, another trainer. Let's go. Okay, Dimitri is an amazing battler. He's the best trainer here. I beg to differ. Uh, let's go for. I think I'm just gonna go with Petal Dance for Twee, even though it's not the best idea. Lunatone, okay, so we did make a pretty decent decision with this. Oh, that tiny sliver of health is what kind of scares me, though. Although Lunatone sort of finished off itself. Gallade, that's what kind of scares me. Okay, it protected itself, so we'll be able to switch into- actually, wait. Can't really switch into Eve, because... Oh, whoa, that did a lot more damage than I expected it to. I think it's sort of time for a cool guy to be switched into. I think a simple Aerial Ace will do the trick, maybe? There we go. And that'll give cool guy some experience. What's next? Metacham. Sure, I'll keep it in cool guy. Uh, let's go Brave Bird just in case Aerial Ace isn't enough. Got hit with some recoil damage, but whatever. Question three, which of these Pokemon are in the Smogon Uber tier? Oh, oh, why? Incorrect position. Oh, man. Okay, let's try this another time. Blah, blah, blah. Smogon Uber. So we've tried Victini and Celebi. How about Mew? Oh. Okay, Excadrill? Oh, jeez. Like, that was a really complicated question, honestly, like... I sh I know there's a lot of people 
that probably would have been like, Oh, you dumb idiot. It's obviously blah, 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 or something. But I'm not, I'm not the type of person to really know that. Let's go for Crunch and Eve's dead. <laughs> I think Frank, who should be able to do the trick, and I forgot to teach him Thunderbolt, which is kind of stupid of me. Future Sight. Oh no, I'm not liking that. Did quite a lot of damage, actually. And Shockwave finishes him off. Great. Or her off, actually. Jinx. I think Mag should easily be able to take out Jinx. If I'm lucky, that is. So Lava Plume. Uh, body Slam. Didn't do that much. <laughs> and we burned the Jinx as well, so we're fine on that. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, I was afraid that was gonna do a lot more damage. It didn't, so that's good. Parish Song, I'm not really afraid of that, since I'm pretty sure we won't be using mags after this turn. Hypno, yeah, we won't, okay. Or maybe we will. Ooh, whoa, 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 let's close that. Did not mean to open that. Actually, we have Dark Pulse, so never mind. I'll keep Mags in. So let's use Dark Pulse in hopes that it does a nice amount of damage. Which did a lot less than I would have wanted it to, but hey, it made the it made the Hypno flinch, so that's good. Psy Shock. Oh, that... Oh, that was a good... I think Dark Pulse is our, is our best chance right now. Oh, it survived by that tiny sliver of health. If Mags hadn't died from the attack, then Parish Song would have killed it anyway, so that kind of sucks. Let's put in Franku, because why not? Ominous Wind, because overkill. Alright, wait, did I... What is... I didn't see their trainer name, but I could have sworn they just had a name like Soda or something. Okay, question four. What is the name of the leader of this gym? It is Dimitri. Alright. So anyways, I know this is probably going to be a lot of a lot more of a shorter episode, but, uh, you know, I don't want to fight the gym leader directly right now, so that's going to be it for this episode. Apologies if it is indeed a bit of a shorter one, but anyways, my name is Lunatic Guy. Be sure to like, fair, subscribe, whatever. Subscribe to join the Brigade, and I shall see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.